Hello everyone, thank you for coming here today. Today we are talking about marketing, so let's spend a few minutes to meet a friend of mine. Her name is Jessica. She's a fashion designer and she graduated with the highest mark in a fashion design in a school in France. After the school, she started immediately to design her first winter collection. As many business owners, she started her business at home, combining professional and personal life. Since her business was going well, she started to think about moving to a more professional space. How many of you are thinking about starting your business at home? I am. Mm -hmm. Which kind of business, Christian? Uh, translating uh, over the net. Translating company, surgeon? Uh, I plan to organize and to uh, have businesses, uh, small, uh, small hotel. Okay. Other ideas? An online radio on the website. Online radio, that's great. Jessica's customers are mainly small but trendy boutiques. She also takes care about some requests that are coming from her friends who advertise her products to others. At that time, she thought that this word of mouth was great but wasn't enough. And she needed to have like a better approach for her marketing. So what she needed was like having marketing tools were fast to develop and fast to maintain. Knowing what the fashion business works, could you give me some example of marketing materials that Jessica could use? Uh, business cards. Business cards. Even flyers, maybe. Flyer, maybe. Nihad. Brochures. A brochure. Hannah. Maybe a website. Right, and that's exactly what she did. Using her friend's PC, she drafted her own flyer to advertise her product. But now, is facing a new challenge, going beyond her city. So, she started to think about having a website. 